Yo, what's going on guys, Stills here, and I'm bringing you commentary today. Uh, the gameplay in the background, which you're going to be watching, is a scrim against Mercy. Uh, we've been playing them quite a lot recently. This is actually Domination on Solverin. I'm not 100% sure how to pronounce that. But this is one of our worst game modes and our worst maps. And to be actually going to win this game, but what's interesting is my kill to death ratio in this match. I'm using the Remington. Um, I haven't used it too much in scrims, uh, but it is a really good weapon. Uh, with a red dot sight, it definitely helps. Um, the commentary topic today, as you'll see from the title, is a new series sort of thing. Um, it was actually suggested by one of my friends in college. Uh, he suggested that I do sort of like a road to commander. Uh, I'm not actually 100% sure what the top rank is called on this game. I think it's around level 60 or 70, so let me know if you think that's a good idea. I personally quite like it, I'll be doing live commentaries uh, using red guns, snipers, uh, wh whatever you want me to use. Uh, if you just like drop a comment saying whether you think I should do this or not, and what gun you think I should use, and I'll try and make a class around that gun and try and do my best online. Uh, obviously it'll be a live commentary, so there's no saying whether I do well or not, uh, whether I'll have a good game or start raging. Um, speaking of raging, uh, I actually uploaded a live commentary the other day, and I'll put an annotation in the top right hand corner right now. So you can check that out, uh, please leave a like. Once it hits 30 likes, I'm going to be recording another live commentary. Um, I get free houses on Tuesdays and Thursdays, so that's the main days I'll be able to record live comms. Uh, I don't really want to do it when my parents are in because it's a bit awkward. Um, <laughs> another topic for this commentary is about an outro. Um, I'm not talking about like a video outro, I'm talking more about like what I can say at the end of my videos. Uh, once again, if you see my live comm, you'll see my outro. It wasn't great, I kind of winged it a bit. Uh, I didn't really know what to say, so I was just like, yo, what's up? see you later, bye, and all that sort of stuff. But I'd quite like a suggestion in the comments, uh, whether it's a funny one or a serious one. Um, I'll pick the best one, and I'll give you a shout out or something. Um, also, uh, in this gameplay, you may see that we're not actually playing with Roberts 434, or 343, whatever his name is. Um, it's actually because it was a joint decision that we dropped him. Uh, this is mainly because he's, he's not as dedicated as the rest of us, me, Sam and Ben. We kind of are always online and we let each other know in advance if we're going to miss a day or if we've got to go for dinner or something. It's fair enough if you've got dinner but when it's halfway through a scrim and you haven't given us any warning and you just go off without telling us and we're kind of just sitting there just like, oh, where's he gone? Um, it's it's quite frustrating, especially when we choke maps and lose it because we're down to a three v four. But the new person we picked up is called Cameron or Cam or Cammy, whatever he wants to be called, and he's a fantastic player. I don't know why I said fantastic. It's like the first time I've said it since like, fucking primary school. But he is a really good player, all round SMG and AR. Um, he really helped us out in this game and me and him really did drop a lot of kills and getting the caps and it was really game changing really. Um, another thing with Jack, he would, halfway through a scrim he would just go off just randomly, just turn off his Xbox, he wouldn't tell us and we'd lose the map obviously and then he'll come back like an hour late and be like oh well, I had dinner and kind of just expect us to accept that. Uh, we really want like dedicated players that are going to play with us and so that we know what we're doing and building up chemistry which is one of the main game changing things in competitive Call of Duty and with anything really. Uh, if you want to win, saying you need good chemistry with your teammates, whether it's football, COD, basketball, whatever. Um, uh, one of the problems I see with our team is consistency. Um, we kind of we play really well like we we always play well but towards the end of the game or at the start of the game uh, it's either one or the two we always choke like a round on search or a couple of flags on domination or a couple of blitz points but then we always seem to pull it back which is it's quite a weird thing if we could just keep that consistent say through the entire match 
we would easily win all of our games. Um, as I say, we haven't really lost too many scrim. Well, we've not lost any scrims. We've dropped a few maps against like some proper top class players. Um, we haven't actually won too many GBs, but we haven't played too many, so it's not really a problem. Anyway, guys, this gameplay is wrapping up now. Uh, we actually won this by quite a few points, 17 points, I think, if my maths is right. Um, I really went off, 17 and 4, with 5 captures. Uh, I thank you so much, guys, for watching. I'm Stelves. See you later, guys. Peace.